Hi guys, um, this is the, the video of the um, Betaflight F3 uh, flight controller from uh, FPV model uh, in English. Uh, someone asked me, uh, can you talk about this flight controller in English? Yeah, no problem. Um, I just make more uh, Portuguese videos because there aren't many. So in English there are many videos. About this flight controller, there are uh, low or none because this is very new, and I and I was the one of the first to to get this. So let's open the box. This comes in the nice uh, neat box, um, great for, for protection and uh, nice presentation too. This flight controller is uh, somehow um, nice because it includes. Uh, black box, black box with with the SD card. Uh, you can just plug the SD card directly, and you have black box. Uh, it's with PDB, so you don't need an extra PDB. You just uh, solder the ESCs under the flight controller, current sensor, and OSD uh, all all in one flight controller. So. And it's uh, developed by Boris B, which is the um, developer of the um, Betaflight uh, um, flight controller software. So the main developer of the software uh, made this with the FPV model. So you can expect this as one of the best flight controllers to run Betaflight. Uh, it, it includes uh, a bootloader button, so you can uh, flash easily the flight controller. Um, I checked and already includes um, the target in Betaflight, so you can assure this is um, supported and uh, it's already supported. Uh, today uh, it was released the Betaflight 3.1 uh, RC1, which already has the the correct file for flashing this flight controller it should be flashed from factory either way you have already the target released for public so you can flash it again if you want uh, as the flight controller itself the current sensor the current sensor is rated up to 150 uh, amps so it should be work fine the the osd is uh, uh, configurable or set up by the Betaflight uh, GUI interface in the Chrome, so you don't need any extra software to configure it. You just open Betaflight uh, GUI in the Chrome app and you configure the, the OSD by there. Uh, it's all simple. Um, it uses the, the MPU uh, 6000, which is um, very reliable and low noise spec uh, gyro and accelerometer it's uh, very reliable so you can expect good things from this flight controller at this time i didn't test it as you can see it's not soldered but uh, some people already tested and they say it's really really great i want to test it in a low profile uh, build because this includes everything you just need to solder the ESCs put some motors, uh, some um, video transmitter camera and radio receiver and you have all you need to, to go flying. Uh, this is my um, quick view of the Betaflight F3. If you have some uh, doubts or some comments, just put them below in the comment section. I will try my best to answer them. Uh, and don't forget, if you like this video, you want more about us, you want to know more about this flight controller uh, it like button because that helps to to make the video uh, make better videos thank you